guys, it's Mary. Welcome back to Exodus Hex Six Six. Still, one of you has requested how to make the gradient subscribe button that I used on the Tumblr Ensley number two, the Marble one. So I'm just going to show it. Um, I'm going to show you. Sorry, that was my desk. <laughs> I'm going to show you how to make it in two ways because the first way that I made it, um, it's cute, but there's another way to make it even cuter. So. Yeah, but basically what you want to do is go to Google and type black subscribe button, 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 subscribe, okay, perfect, whatever. I'm going to go to image, and you want to find, I think Google pulls up the same pictures, but you want to find this one. This one is the one that I use, you can use any one, but make sure it's black. Um, and then go to save image and you want to save it. I already have it, so I'm not going to save it right now. Um, and then you want to go to pick monkey. Also, guys, remember to leave some requests down below. And we're going to make those videos. But yeah, back to your tutorial. You want to go to design. I miss you guys. It has been a long time that I make tutorials with my boys or <laughs> whatever. Um, so the first way that is the way that I made it is on transparent canvas. You want to go and click on transparent canvas and then go on overlays and um, look for your subscribe button. Okay, like that. It's going to appear a little blurry, but uh, the next step is going to make it look like better, I guess. Um, you can use a gradient background, you just want to look for Tumblr gradient oh, background. Okay, I spell horrible. I type horrible. Um, but yeah, you just want to save the one you like and then go on Pigmonkey again and open it um, like your gradient. And then you just want to flip it over because like this is the one that I used. Um, and then if you're not sure if it's straight or not, you want to right click and go to straighten. Okay, my was already straightened, but whatever. Uh, you just want to make it bigger. Okay. And you just want to fade it out. And then you just save it. Um, but you have to cut it to crop it. So it's just like the subscribe button without the rest of the gradient, if you understand. <laughs> um, and then you just want to save it. But now to the other part, uh, the second way to do it is go into canvas color and make your canvas white. And then click on the overlay and go uh, take out your fade and go to add. And it will make your button to have this and then if you just want to crop it and you just want like the subscribe in the border we have a tutorial on how to make that that it's called how to make design text if you watch the video you basically follow the same steps and yeah you can save it but yeah guys hope you like this tutorial if you did make sure to thumbs up this video and comment some video request and that's everything guys bye